Not gonna lie, uh, just after I shot that shot, I may have fallen over. There was, there was an icy patch on the floor and I went arse over tit. Hey guys, and it's the new year finally. I uh, hope you guys had a great holiday period slash new year. Um, and it's time to actually, for me, to get back into going to the gym properly again. I've been super busy with work, as you may have, or may not have known if you've been watching some of the videos. Well, now it's kind of dying off a little bit, which allows me to actually get back into doing the gym stuff again. Um, most people always start in January because it's kind of this new year, new me kind of bullshit, um, which honestly I don't believe in. Uh, if you want to start doing something, you should not wait for a specific date to start doing it. You should just do it then and there. If you're really motivated, you should just start as soon as possible, shouldn't you? Anyway, starting my new program today. Well, it's kind of a new program. I'm back on the conjugate method, which I'm sure many people will um, argue that it's not the best method, but I enjoy it. So it keeps me in the gym and it keeps it fresh every single week or so for me. Today is the first day of my programming, which will be run in 12 week cycles, um, going from the hardest to the easiest. So today is lower day, max effort lower, starting with squats. And for this variation, I'm gonna be doing the hardest front squats with bands. I'll be honest, I'm not gonna have to a very good start today. One, I nearly left my GoPro at home again, and two, I forgot it's bank holiday, which means the gym shuts in about two hours. So it's now gonna be a very short session uh, for the rush. To be honest, this isn't exactly the best start to my new program, is it? Like, I've not really had much luck lately with the gym or time management in general, to be honest. So yeah, I always seem to be rushing somewhere and just to make things worse, one of my legs of my Gorilla Pod has now just fallen off. <sighs> Why? I live in such a beautiful place. This car follows me everywhere. I see it in work, I see it at the shop, and now I'm seeing it here. Either a lot of people own pink Fiat, or it's just a coincidence that I seem to be in the same place at the same time as that car all the time. Mm. My original plan for the day was to obviously go to the gym, but I wanted to try and shoot some more time lapses again because I'm slightly behind. I've only got like one or two left to use. Um, sadly, I got up late, which is understandable because, well, I had a busy time in work lately. Which obviously means I don't get to do all the things I wanted to do today. Uh, it was nice to have a lie in, but yeah, now I've got to go and rush to the gym because bank holiday and it shuts early. Why do I do this to myself? Why? Honestly, I'm a little bit sad about the uh, time lapse thing because one, the sun's kind of nice today, although there aren't many clouds in the sky, and two, I had time to do it. Why did I get up late? Why? One of these days when I actually have time, I'm going to come shoot a time lapse of this building because it's probably actually one of the nicest buildings that's in this town. Not going to lie, uh, just after I shot that shot, I may have fallen over. There was, there was an icy patch on the floor and I went arse over tit. And I'm disappointed that I didn't catch it on camera. Ow. <laughs> Right, so almost at the gym now. The time now is 20 to 5 and the gym shuts at 6. Which means I now have to have a super short session. Probably only get the max effort main work in and no accessories, but thankfully it's an accessory day tomorrow. So yeah, let's go do some work and actually get some exercise in.
Hey guys, and welcome to the voiceover section of my video now. Uh, I figured why I'm starting a new program in 2017 that it would be a good idea for me to actually explain my thoughts and feelings from these days. Uh, so yeah, this is the first week of the conjugate system and I am starting with max effort lower. As I explained earlier, I'm going to be working from the hardest exercise to the easiest exercise throughout this entire program, well, cycle, anyway. Um, and this week's exercise is the hardest of the leg ones and it is front squats with some bands. Um, these red bands, if you can see them, add 12, 12 and a half kilos each. So at the top, it's going to be 25 kilos heavier than the free weight. Um, I have never in my entire life done this exercise before. I've done front squats and I've done banded other squats, but never together um, front squats with bands. Last time I tested my actual front squat max, it was probably around 117 kilos. So to get somewhere around that with the bands would be kind of ha good by me since I've not actually done front squats in a good few months now. Which I'll be completely honest about. As you can see here, it's not exactly the best form. I probably need to work on that, but that just shows up that I have weaknesses and like technique issues that I need to work on. And if I do improve those, I'll improve overall throughout the course of this cycle. But yeah, here's my max for the day, which I managed to work up to 85 kilos with the band. So that equaled somewhere around 105, 110 kilos at the top or something, which I'm more than happy with. As I said, not done front squats in forever and it's not too far away from my max used to be. Honestly, watching it back now, it looks a little bit easy, but on the day, I assure you, it felt terrible. I think my form was kind of breaking down because my upper back kind of cave in. If you watch that clip again, if you go back and watch it, my upper back begins to round and the bar's kind of slipping off my like collarbone and shoulders where it should be rested. Um, but I'll work on that as time goes by. Afterwards, as prescribed, Per usual with the conjugate system, I'll drop down to 80% of that max and then do three sets of five with the same exercise, then move on to my accessories. Accessories this time, I'm going to be doing a little bit different. I'm going to be working in a lot more quad work because I figured that that is like a major weakness of mine, as well as working in a lot more glute work. So basically that's going to be me doing a lot more leg extensions and leg press and also including new exercises such as glute bridges and I may do some good mornings as well. That's kind of it for the voiceover section for this week. If you like the voiceover section, please let me know in the comments. If not, also let me know. But I figured doing voiceovers, it'll kind of let you guys learn a little bit more about my thoughts and processes in the gym and hopefully it'll educate you a little bit and we'll all learn together. Thanks for watching guys. First day back wasn't the worst day ever. Um, slight issue with everything around it, but the actual exercise itself, not so bad. Uh, I managed to work up to the equivalent of 105 kilo front squat, which isn't bad because I've not done one in months. So yeah, just I got a few exercises in accessory wise and then just call it a day there. Tomorrow is an accessory day though, so I'll just make up for it. Oop, nearly died there. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. Anyway, going to go get some food, uh, then go home and meal prep for the week. This week I'm going to be trying something a little bit different and making something kind of like a fajita, but without the wrap. So yeah, going to go do that. Anyway guys, if you liked it, don't forget to like it. If not, ignore it. And uh, yeah, like, subscribe, comment, share, do whatever you want. And I'll see you all next time. I, I, I,